Hello and welcome back guys. Today we will be starting with a shop ad mockup. This is a very short uh, tutorial for you all. And uh, if you have been following our channel for a certain amount of time or even if you have watched at least 2-3 long videos of ours, you know the drill. So we will be showing in short and uh, in a summarized manner how you can do this mockup in very very easy steps and let me remind you that uh, if you want to download the PhD file of this mockup then so as you can see that we had already selected one uh, design now we will drag and drop it on the shape that we have just selected by pressing ctrl T we can just adjust the size of this design and then right click on this design and then convert it to smart object we have not taken any other shapes or anything here we will be doing this directly we will adjust the size a little we will decrease the opacity a little so that we can see the shape behind it better now we will right click on this shape and we will select dissolve with it you can just adjust the banner you can place the points according to the shape make sure that you do it very very minutely because we will not be using mask paint tool or anything As you can see, we have placed it properly. Now we will adjust and see if there is anything that needs to be changed or fixed before we do the effects and all. You can zoom in by pressing Ctrl plus and check. I would suggest you do. Now place OK and then increase the opacity completely. Now from keep from the keyboard press control and select the layer or click on the very corner button of the square shape and then pressing the control J and select a copy of it except the background part all right now from normal we will be converting it to multiple So you see there is a nice effect. Then again pressing Ctrl J make a copy from and this layer will be converted to screen from multiply. It was in multiply we will convert it to screen. Once you do it you will see there is a lightning effect. And then we'll go to image adjustments and levels the options will be there chronologically and then you can just adjust the levels according to your preference how you want the lighting and all as you can see i have adjusted it when you are done press ok then again Press Ctrl and select those two layers and then create clipping mask. And then going to the smart object, we'll highlight it in red so that we know that this is an editable part and this is the main part that varies your design. So and we will also rename it as name your design. You can keep it as usual either. And then press the multiply layer as shadow and then the upper one. 
the screen one as light. So as you can see, you can switch on and switch off the layers and see the effects. And as you see, we are done with this mock-up with this easy steps. Thank you for watching. Yeah, both the 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 the